Hi, I'm Jay Kahn. I'm running for State Senate in District 10. I'm running for State Senate to represent you, the citizens of District 10, in the State Senate, to advocate on your behalf and to help improve the lives of the citizens in Cheshire County. My passion for helping others has come from my 43 years of leadership and transforming lives through education. I possess the skills, the expertise, and the executive leadership, leadership experience to make it that kind of positive change. People who've worked with me know that I listen, I define problems well, I engage people in the solutions, and I get things done. And for that reason, I am supported by over 30 elected officials who represent you, the citizens of Cheshire County. This includes Senator Molly Kelly, who I hope to succeed as the state senator, Congressman Annie Custer, 12 Democratic state representatives, 11 of my fellow city councilors, the current mayor, and the past mayor of Keene. What they know is that I possess the skills, experience, and leadership. And I've demonstrated that at a national, regional, and local level. Over my 28 years at Keene State College as Vice President for Finance and Planning, I helped lead over $400 million of improvements at the campus. My engagement with the community has come through my efforts uh, with the Chamber of Commerce, where I was the chairman of the board and helped implement a workforce coordinator program. Through the creation of Monadnet, the first internet service uh, supporting the Monadnock region. As the leader of the Monadnock Economic Development Corporation, leveraging incentives to help businesses grow and start up in Cheshire County. I've chaired the Cheshire Medical Center Board of Directors, and I was asked to support to, to create and establish the first guardian ad litem child advocacy service for abused and neglected kids, CASA, in this portion of the state to represent those kids uh, from those households uh, in Cheshire and Sullivan counties. My desire is to expand the economic opportunities for people in this region. And to do that, we've got to retain and attract a workforce that's going to help businesses who are here and that are growing have the workforce that they need for the 21st century. This includes the manufacturing, information, technologies, and health professionals needed to support this region. My, develop, my, my priorities are as follows. Economic development through retaining and attracting and training a better workforce. Through educational opportunities that start at zero to five, expand the early childhood opportunities both through assessment and through education and by articulating the curriculum uh, from daycare centers into kindergarten to help those developmental opportunities grow in, in, in those nurturing years to improve our elementary and secondary schools, to improve the access to higher education, and to improve the, uh, the workforce training and retraining needed uh, to continue to grow and innovate in this region. I want to help expand access to health care. I will support the expanded Medicaid and Planned Parenthood, and we need to expand the mental health services available in this region. We want to have more secure communities, and uh, we need to address issues of income, housing, and food insecurity. And largely, those things come from uh, the misuse and abuse of uh, drugs, and we need to have a strong enforcement, education, and most particularly, treatment programs that are effective and last through people's recovery. We need to expand broadband in this region so that people have the technology for their businesses at home and in the workplace to grow. We need safe highways and bridges like that in Hinsdale on Route 119. And we need to expand alternative energies. I want to represent you to make this region grow and be more effective. And in order to do that, I'll need your vote on September 13th in the primary. 
Over 30 public officials serving you endorse my candidacy. And I hope that if you need more information on my candidacy, you'll go to conforsenate.com. Thank you very much.